Two guys meet by chance and decide to start a business together, zapping bed bugs. Yeah, you're sleeping and these yeah. things are feeding on you like little miniature vampires. I mean, it's really creepy. This is News on Main, your connection to small business. Andrew Havlis was enjoying a book in bed one night when a little bug ran across the page. Slammed the book closed and I looked at it and was like, what the hell is that? And I got on the internet, looked it up, and it was a bed bug, and I completely freaked out. Andrew started chatting about his bed bug plight with engineer grad Cameron Wheeler, who was looking to get involved in a startup. Next thing you know, Cameron was on a mission. I went to Home Depot, got some, got a heater, a box, a couple other things, made a bed bug oven, and did a bunch of testing, figured out that we could make them for pretty cheap. Discovering that bed bugs die at 120 degrees Fahrenheit, they designed a pop-up box that attaches to a small portable heater. The Zap Bug Oven was born. You know, especially if people have had an experience with bed bugs, they think it's a really good idea because they know how freaked out you get, how there are very few resources out there. You know, I talked to a lady not that long ago who was sleeping in her bathtub and just hysterical and crying when I talked to her. Uh, another lady a couple a couple weeks ago, actually, whose boyfriend broke up with her. He said, you can't get rid of them, and I never want to see you again. Andrew and Cameron started having the Zap Bug Oven manufactured in China. They received their initial batch just as their first client came knocking. I got an email from a hotel in New York, a really nice hotel, and they wanted to buy one. It was awesome, perfect timing. Zapbug now has many hotel customers in the U.S., and they just signed a distribution deal in Europe. They're also developing smaller ovens, as well as a large room that can fit beds and couches. And we wanted to develop a one-stop resource for how to get rid of bed bugs, but we also wanted to come up with a product to help people do that. Not just one product, but multiple products. Two strangers, brought together by bedbugs, are now a dynamic business duo. Feels awesome. Yeah. That's uh, exciting. Surreal? Just, yeah. You don't really realize it. Um, but when the words start rolling in, you're like, wow. <laughs> we did make the right call. <laughs> How did that happen? That's your news on Maine. Thanks for watching. Did we check this for bugs?